First at 5.30, we have some new details on a fire in a North Kingstown substance abuse treatment facility. I'm Kim Kalunian. I'm Mike Montecalvo. The fire started at AdCare just before 5 o'clock this morning and has now displaced more than 50 people living at the facility. 12 News reporter Molly O'Brien spoke to fire officials and has the details on what happened and what this means for those who live there. Molly? AdCare has multiple locations within Rhode Island and Massachusetts, but this North Kingstown facility is the only inpatient program within the state. We've learned that AdCare is working with partner organizations and the state to help find their clients continuing coverage. Busted windows, caution tape, and a charred walkway. That's what's left after a two alarm fire ripped through a hallway at the AdCare Substance Abuse Rehab Hospital on Tower Hill Road Monday morning. 57 people were evacuated with no injury. They won't be back into this building today. Day for sure. With help from North Kingstown Recreation, 51 residents were bused to a site provided by the University of Rhode Island. AdCare officials say they are working with partners to provide patient care. Chief Scott Cattell says crews fought heavy fire conditions in about one third of the building. The fire was in a center core of the building. The building is broken out into three wings. Cattell says the fire moved quickly through a hallway, but a safety feature stopped the fire from spreading. There was fire doors that kept the fire in check so it didn't get into the areas where the people were in. In a statement provided to 12 News, an ad care spokesperson says in part, we want to thank our first responders for their quick response. As a result, our building sustained only partial damage. State and local fire marshals were on scene throughout the day to determine if ad care can reopen sections of the building within the next few days. No word on what started or the cause of the fire. This fire is currently still under investigation. In North Kingstown, I'm Molly O'Brien, 12 News.